Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Dear brothers and sisters, today I'd like to share a reflection with you about Asiya alayhi salam as one of the women of the Quran. I feel that Asiya alayhi salam is someone we can all draw inspiration from. If we look at her story, it's one which displays incredible faith and incredible endurance. See, Asiya alayhi salam was married to a tyrant ruler who considered himself to be God. Now, when Asiya alayhi salam believed in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, this meant that she would be openly rejecting Fir'aun and his people would witness this. So, of course, Fir'aun could not let this happen. So, what he decided to do is to make an example of Asiya alayhi salam and to make an example of her death. So what we find is that when Asiya alayhi salam was laying on that ground and no, knew that death was imminent, then what were the words on her lips? Subhanallah, she said, Rabbi bni li indaka baytan fil jannah. So she asked Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala at that moment for a house in jannah. But not just that. Not just any house, she asked to be specifically placed next to him. So subhanAllah, do you see the level of faith that Asiya alayhi salam had? And I'm sure, just like myself, you're perhaps thinking that if we were to face a similar situation and to find ourselves having to choose our faith over our life, would we be able to do the same? And this also encourages us to think about our brothers and sisters around the world who may be facing such a situation and to pray that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grant us the kind of faith that Asiya alayhi salam had. Allahumma ameen.